that. That's it. Okay. Clear that now. And I'm going to click Save Changes here. And go back to the File Manager. And I'm going to open my a new tab. And I'm going to browse to that file. Eatmemo.com phpinfo.php here we have the PHP settings okay now I'm gonna you have to go search control F see you have the configuration settings with IMAP there I'm gonna use my highlighter where's my highlighter um, highlighter here with IMAP so we have those installed right we even have IMAP SSL so we can use IMAP SSL as well if we do want to use SSL so let's click um, next if I can show you IMAP here see you can check this part as well make sure your PHP info have this if you don't have it your ticketing in WHMCS will not work okay so make sure you have that and if you don't have it submit a support ticket to your web hosting provider and ask to have them install the PHP IMAP module it should be free it should be already installed if not you're in a bad host change to a good one <laughs> okay so um, that's that I'm gonna close this so we have IMAP and even if you on a VPS server you you need to know how to install IMAP maybe I can show you to install your own IMAP on your existing PHP later on you can compile your own IMAP and install it in your VPS or your dedicated server so that's that so I'm sure IMAP is on board so we can start creating our new support departments now move the duo board on the left and click new department here see WHMCS linking system or navigational system is not so good sometimes links disappears as text they should change those to buttons like big buttons or something because I don't see this if I'm not familiar with WHMCS so I'm not what's next this is next okay so okay click on that add new department technical support or just maybe support whether it's, it's technical or not support my email will be support at eatmemo.com you can tick this if you want it to be clients only here you can tick this pipe replies only no don't do that because we are using the IMAP okay no autoresponder do not send autoresponder message for new tickets we, we do want to send it so we, we want to use this I mean do not tick this okay hidden no we want it to be not hidden okay so we want to use that so let's go back to windows and clients only no pipe replies only no no autoresponder no hidden no so everything should be just as it is okay scroll down to the bottom now here if you're using a cpanel host your host name should be mail dot your domain my case is eatmemo.com and the login name should be support plus plus that's that's a plus sign eatmemo.com and the password should be my password not your password right and I'm gonna s click add department now so there we have it we have one department and I'm gonna add two more the same thing I'm gonna click add new department here second one is sales 
sales at eatmemo.com and just scroll down here mail here is sales plus the plus sign my password click add department okay the last one is um, billing okay we want to separate those so these are the guys who's gonna be handling my money okay <laughs> billing 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 at eatmemo.com everything leave it as it is hostname mail dot eatmemo dot com here's billing plus sign remember to use the plus your domain name dot com if you're using the cpanel web hosting account if you you're using other web hosting control panel or system such as plask or HSphere or you're using GoDaddy or Enom or something else please make sure you enter their format which I'm not sure okay so here I'm gonna use my password and click add department so there we have it we have three departments but we're not done yet so you've added these three right you've added these three departments but do you have an email account created for these three already if not you have to make sure this email accounts you set up exist so here I'm gonna show you on how I'm gonna create exactly what we need okay cpanel here um, click on email accounts email accounts on your cpanel and I'm gonna click email accounts just add the email accounts so what do we have now we have well, we have sales and support already created, so I'm going to add one more billing. Just perfect for this demo, okay? Billing. My password is going to show no. My password 